Welcome to today's episode of The Chitty Chef. I have been eating quite a lot lately, and if you've seen all the stuff that I cook, it's usually not good for you. So I am doing a cleanse. Is this the best one? I don't know, because I'm probably not going to do it anymore after this. This is actually the second time I'm doing it. But uh, before we start, don't forget, like and subscribe. If you do, I will love you very, very much. Not that way, though. Unless, like, that's what you want. Uh, like and subscribe. So this is for a gallon recipe. I have a little bit less than a gallon. You're going to add a cup of syrup into it. This is supposed to be really good. You gotta do like warm salt water cleanses afterwards with it. And uh, 16 ounces of lemon juice. This is freshly squoezed. This is about 10 lemons. And I'm hoping it's gonna all fit. Perfect. Now, cayenne pepper. <laughs> like and subscribe, like and subscribe. Oh, my memory card ran out of battery while I was filming the putting in the cayenne pepper. It says about a tablespoon and a half. I did like two and a half, something like that. I too like to live dangerously. So, it's a, uh, a gallon of water, a cup of maple syrup, 16 ounces of freshly squoozed lemons, and a couple of tablespoons of uh, cayenne. And this, and the salt water flush, is the only thing I'm going to be consuming for the next week. But fear not, last night I ate a whole ton of McDonald's. So that'll probably get me through the next couple days. Let's give it a nice little uh, taste test. I'm very hungry already. It hasn't even been a full day and I'm already pretty hungry, but this will get me through once again. Now I'm sad. But I'll give you daily updates and I'll probably be pretty angry. Hangry is the word for it. And uh, let's see how it goes. It is day two of the cleanse. I'm not feeling quite as hungry as I thought I would. Last night was really bad. Today hasn't been too bad because I've been drinking a bunch of hooch or a bunch of stuff, but I just spent $14 on 20 lemons. They're 89 cents a piece. This almost makes me wish I was back in Florida because lemons are obviously cheaper there. What's that behind you? Yeah. It's clear. It doesn't count, and I haven't had beer in so long, and I can't have beer for the whole week, so I gotta drink something. I decide to not eat and do this cleanse for one week, and Hangover Brother is making beans and rice. How could you? How could you? Because I ain't doing cleanse, I'm hungry. This is day three of the cleanse. I am not, I'm pretty hungry, but luckily I'm not going to bed hungry, nor am I waking up hungry. I don't know how that's working out. And I am down seven pounds in three days, which is pretty good. Um, I do have, I've been watching a lot of YouTube cooking shows, so I do have some ideas of what I'm going to make when I get back to cooking, but I can't do anything right away because you can't just go from not eating to eating solid foods right again. So I'm going to have to do some soups first and foremost. But we'll see how tomorrow turns out. Today is day four. I lost another pound and honestly today I woke up full of energy. I did some squats, push-ups, and sit-ups even though I wasn't going to, but I had a lot of energy and I wanted to. This usually happens day four or five. You'll get a bunch of energy. And then I was thinking sometimes people bite off more than they can chew. And I came across this song that you guys might know. But this guy did a really good job of it. It must have taken him a long time. I remember that song when I was in high school and I never thought anybody would make a clean version of it. 
but I came across it and it cracked me up. Thanks for watching. Yes, I did wake up with a lot of energy, but today I am hungry. Damn it, I am so hungry. I just want to eat everything. And I was thinking about chili oil from my time in China. And Amazon makes it too damn easy to buy things on here now. Three clicks, I have chili oil being sent to me. I didn't even have to put anything, no credit card information because it's got it on file. I can't even eat the chili oil when it gets here because it'll probably be here by the end of the week because you gotta kinda slowly work your way back into eating food. Um, but now I'm just like, there's so many things I wanna buy on Amazon food related and I've been watching a lot of other food YouTube videos. By the way, I like Strictly Dumpling, Binging with Babish, Google Foods, Sous Vide Everything. If you haven't seen Sous Vide Everything, they sous vide everything. I'm so hungry right now. I'm so hungry. I'm so hungry. It is day five. I've lost zero pounds uh, from yesterday. Today I went on a bike ride and I got very tired very quickly and also got pretty hungry within the first five minutes. Uh, but then I got home, drank some juice. It's working. Kind of, sort of. I'm still kind of hungry, but it's not too bad. It's day five. This is the hungriest I've been because I don't really feel like buying any more lemons and drinking that stuff anymore, so I only drank um, a bottle full of it. I'm very, very hungry. I have tomorrow, and after tomorrow, I can finally eat again. I will say this. Don't be all that mad. I have been cheating just a little bit, and I'll show you what I'm talking about. Oh, occasionally I've been having a little nightcap. It's good for you to help disinfect any internal injuries that you might have. But this doesn't really taste all that good. And before I started this cleanse, I bought something and I tried it and I ate the whole thing. Mango habanero pickles. And I will say these are delicious. So... I have a little bit of the juice left, and honestly, I diluted it a little bit. This it makes it so much more tolerable, and it ends up being delicious. I'm not really one for pickles, I'd never buy them, but I just had to try them, and they were delicious. So, makes it a lot more tolerable. It tastes good. Try it out. Today is the last day at about 11 o'clock tonight will be exactly seven days or a whole week since I have eaten. So I have some more of this stuff and I'll be honest, yesterday I only drank one of these. I'm on my second one this morning uh, because I didn't want to buy more maple syrup and squeeze more lemons. Um, and yesterday after I did my salt water flush, you got to use like kosher salt or like sea salt or something that's decent, not the regular table salt with warm water. You chug it. Um, I've been doing that almost every day. Uh, honestly, I was not feeling good. I was feeling pretty tired. I didn't want to continue doing this, but I figured I had one more day. Why not? So now today I'm actually drinking this again. I'm feeling a lot better. And today I'm actually going to make some soup that I will eat first thing tomorrow morning when I wake up. But in the meantime, let's check out my final progress. Let's see how well I did, or how well this cleanse worked, how you lose weight, whatever it is. So I did the master cleanse for one week. I think this one's called the master cleanse. I start off at 186 pounds or 84 and a half kilos, and that's my waist uh, around my belly, around my fattest part. And this is what I ended up with. For a total weight loss of 10 pounds, four and a half kilos, and inches lost from around my stomach, I lost two and a half inches or 6.35 centimeters. So, yes, I am happy about that. I'm finally done. With I do this. want to mention one thing. This is very, very important. Always consult your physician or a doctor before starting anything like this. Unless you're brown, then you don't have a doctor or anyone to consult. So, don't, don't say that I told you to do it, but I'm just letting you know what I did.
Come on, come on. Come on. Come on, cook. I know this doesn't look good. It's lentil soup. You can't eat anything like really heavy. Uh, so this is going to be my first full spoonful of food uh, in over a week. It's really good. It's really good. I'm, not, I'm gonna try not to eat too much of it because then that'll be bad, but thank you very much for watching. Hope you like and subscribe at the bottom. I'm gonna go back to actually cooking food again. Um, and I'm actually really, really looking forward to it. So this is delicious. Mm. I'm happy to be eating again. Thank you very much for watching. Goodbye.